everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If it is your first time joining us, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Zaman. As you guys know, I did promise you guys an Allegal Pro HD foundation um, review. And so um, that is what I have for you guys today. Um, I'm sorry it took so long for me to do because genuinely um, I recorded it twice and it just came out really trash and nasty. And so I was like, you know what, I don't want to disrespect other people's kids, other people's eyes, other people's ears. With trash so um, I went ahead and recorded for the last time and hopefully you guys like how it came out if you guys are into review videos and you'd like me to do some more please don't forget to give me a thumbs up don't forget to leave me a comment in the comments bar below and of course don't forget to subscribe to my channel now let's get straight into this review okay guys basically um, this is how the Elego Pro coverage HD long way found illuminating foundation looks like i'm in the color toast this be my color with everything done if you guys would like to see um my demo please do carry on watching this video basically this um foundation is around 175 grand at discam stores where they own i think that's the only um retail shop that does stock um allego pro if i am correct correct me if i'm wrong but that is the only one that i'm aware of um, i don't know if i already mentioned them, but mentioned this but i'm in the color toast i really really love this foundation number one full coverage it is a hundred percent full coverage it is as it says on the um on the packaging it's 100 percent full coverage you guys will see the demo as well it literally covers it up from the first application and the first layer you will see that there is a lot of coverage that it gives you number two um illuminate illuminating properties i know he was going to say illuminosity and i don't know if that's a real word but anyways um illuminating this foundation is so freaking illuminating like as you guys can see I, you have that inner glow that that thing that's like you look hard and you guys will see as well when i'm applying it that you can already see the um the light that it brings to your foundation and to your skin um long wear this foundation is super long wear i've worn it twice or three times before and it literally has stayed on my face for the entire day so probably around 9 a.m to like in the evening around 8 9 and it hasn't given me any problems with too much shine or, or anything like that i haven't had to block my skin too much which i freaking love because a lot of my other foundations i do have to touch it up and stuff if i'm trying to wear it the whole day so i love that i don't have to do it with this foundation i also love the fact that um there's so many shades that you can choose from literally at this came i found so many freaking shades like i was even like lost in between what i should do and which shade i should go for um i was stuck between this shade and tough and coffee which i pretty much think they both kind of suit my skin tone but i just decided to go with this one there was no specific reason i was just like well they both look the same so um yeah the other thing I wanted to chat to you guys was about the packaging. The packaging is so freaking durable. I've dropped this thing because I am a klutz. If you guys know this about me, you know me. Like literally, I'm such a klutz. I've I even dropped this thing during the demo. I don't know if I'm going to edit it out or not, but um, genuinely, I'm a fool. So um, for people like me, this packaging is bomb. It's not going to break if you drop it. So that's perfect for me. <laughs> like genuinely, it's the best thing. Also, guys. <laughs> I don't know if I already mentioned this, this is 175 grand, such great value for money. Honestly, one of the best um, drugstore foundations that I've ever used, genuinely, no lie, I'm not even joking. Um, one of the best that I've used, I really do recommend you guys go, out, go ahead and get this. Any brown skin go out, I promise you, you will find your shade. Light skins, I think you will also find your um, shade as well if you have a more fair skin tone. Genuinely, um, this bomb. So I'm going to stop doing the talking now and I'm going to let my demo do the talking. So I hope you guys enjoy my little demo. Alrighty guys, as I told you guys, I am in the color toast and I'm going to go ahead and apply this on the back of my hand like I usually do with my other foundations. I've already primed my skin by the way, so um, just to let you know. I'm going to go ahead with my beauty blender and I'm just going to, I, I did maybe about a pump and a, and a bit. I'm just going to put this all over my skin. Um, as you guys can see, there is a lot of discover discoloration on my skin, so I'm hoping that it's going to black it out. So, as you guys can see, this one is pretty accurate when it comes to my skin tone. I'm just going to dab it on my cheeks and my chin. Basically, on the lower half of my face first. I just find that um, my forehead usually needs some other attention. So, um, special attention rather. Okay, so as you guys can see, the difference between the bottom half and the top half is that um, this one's covered in lali 
And this top part is um, got a lot of discoloration that you can still see. You guys can obviously see that it has covered up a lot of my dark marks for the most part on the inside of my skin. Um, don't mind the fact that my forehead looks literally significantly darker than the bottom of my face. My forehead in general is much darker than my face, so yeah. I found that this foundation is really nice because it's actually my skin tone. Um, I feel like it's coming up a bit lighter on camera, but I do think that's because this, uh, this foundation is a bit illuminating, so it also has that thing. But um, I found that a lot of my foundations that I do use are a little bit darker for my skin, so this one is freaking perfect. And so I'm just gonna add another pump of the foundation onto the back of my hand. Okay, let's do a pump and a half actually, so we can just touch up any more places, but I mean, you could literally, if I just, wow. If I just put this on the top of my um, forehead, you literally could just go out of the house like that. But I'm looking for a more full coverage look today because I'm going to do the most. So um, I might go in and go over my cheeks again. application next up, i'm gonna go ahead and add in my concealer just to see how everything blends together um the concealer that i do use is the allego pro concealer in the color almond looks like this so i'm gonna see how these products um work together because usually i do find that if i use products from the same brand they tend to blend better and just work better together so we're gonna test out this theory by um, using this one concealer to highlight <laughs> do a little bit of reverse contouring <clears throat> set my concealer off camera then i'll come back to contour Alrighty, guys so as you guys can see i look very washed out and just dull and just borax and just blah. so i'm gonna go ahead and put in my allego pro face high definition matte press powder in the color cocoa i think this is probably the darkest color that they have i'm just gonna go ahead and contour my face this is such an envy step especially in the winter when our complexion is gonna be dead and we're literally gonna just look pale and pasty and nasty you gotta put the color in. So I'm gonna go ahead with this and just warm up, bronze that color, that good stuff. Please do not forget to like this video, comment, and of course to subscribe to my channel. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. You play the safe, I raise the bar, amaze the grace, I praise the Lord, Versace star.